And get out of the limelight, it's my channel. I might make my own channel. Mm -hmm. What's up everyone, Erica here, and I'm back today with another video for you. Erica and guest, her mother, my mother, here's my mom. Uh, I feel like a lot of you guys might already know me. Okay, not know you, but like they've heard of you. Oh, I've talked okay. about you plenty. All Some good of my stuff. Friends. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. For those of you that, well, no, I was going to say for those of you that don't know, she's literally never been on my channel. It's my mom's first time on my channel. And I've had a YouTube channel for like 20 years now. So it's a long time coming. Mm. Started when I was 10. Wow. Today is Diz Giving, which is like Friends Giving, but even better. My beautiful friend, Jossum. You know Jossum. I know Jossum. My mom knows Jossum. We're like this. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's relax. My friend Jossum over at Awesome Jossum invited me and just like a ton of YouTubers, you guys, there's so many of us participating in this. He said, let's do a collab. No swap, no money, no nothing is involved. All you need to do is pretend like we're all gonna be together hosting a Friendsgiving. What would you bring? So we're in a very extensive group chat on Instagram and everyone was kind of calling dibs and I was like, you know, I've always wanted to put together a charcuterie board. Is that how you say it? Yeah. Charcuterie board. That's the right way. The way you charcuterie say it is board. Right way. Okay, great. So that is what we're gonna be doing today. So I called in an expert. That would be me, everybody. My mom knows her way around a cheese board, okay? Not around the kitchen, <laughs> just a cheese board. <laughs> she sure knows how to lay out some cheese. And cut it too. <laughs> Eric and Nicole. I'm gonna put that on there. You need to edit that. <laughs> so that's really what we're gonna be doing today. My mom, like all joking aside, my mom seriously does a lot of hosting. Uh, you host great parties, always a great spread. So really, that's it. If you guys wanna see us put together this beautiful charcuterie board, um, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, we are frauds because we look like this is Thanksgiving. It is actually Halloween day right now. Please don't let us fool you with this like, formal attire. We are setting up a charcuterie board for a small little get together I'm having today for Halloween. We decided against taking my daughter trick or treating so we're doing something small here at the house. Mm -hmm. And it's Hocus Pocus themed so if you're interested in seeing that again I will always leave the videos that I mentioned linked in the description box so always be sure to check the description box if you're interested in anything I say in the video. Uh, so without it. further ado, let's get busy. Excuse me, that is my line. Oh, okay, sorry. So okay. without further ado, let's all go ahead and get on into this video. Let's get it. No. <laughs> You're fired already. You're fired, okay, Donald. Donald, Donald. So I think what we're gonna do, just so the cheese isn't just sitting out, we're gonna start with the other stuff first. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm just gonna kinda show you guys as we go, but I don't wanna toss and do this at the same time, so. A lot of this stuff I bought at Trader Joe's and I know that I talk about Trader Joe's a lot on my channel but that's because I really believe in them. Um, I think that they're very affordable. So that's just kind of my two cents. If you have a Trader Joe's near you and you're down to make a charcuterie board, that's my suggestion. So apricots, nuts. I bought this fig butter from Trader Joe's. Nuts, I have candied walnuts, sweet and spicy pecans. I have pomegranates crackers, the white truffle chips, uh, dark chocolate covered strawberries. I think you guys saw me do these in my fall haul, but this is what I was referring to. I have uh, leaf shaped tortilla chips. I also have the white truffle potato chips that I do have a bit for. Uh, so here are organic garlic non crackers. I'm really excited about those. The fig and olive crisps. I've mentioned these before, such a hit with JD and I, we love them. These little crunch masters. I've got like, I'm gonna show you guys all the cheeses, all the dips, all the cured meats that I purchased. Prosciutto, uh, salami, and then this little deli selection. There is salami, prosciutto, and capricolo. For cheese, I bought this uh, triple cream soft ripened cheese imported from France. So if you're bougie, you gonna like it. Uh, we have double cream brie. We have the blueberry vanilla goat cheese. I know I mentioned this 
mentioned this one you guys plenty of times because it's really good um apples grapes and pomegranates organic pomegranate literally from my mom's backyard and then i do have some pumpkins that i picked up from trader joe's because this is very fall so i wanted it to have a little yeah fall vibe i also bought some of these little like chocolate turtles i thought would be cute to have out and then for the chips, I grabbed the, the sour cream spinach dip from Trader Joe's and then the cauliflower jalapeno dip from Trader Joe's. I'm exhausted just from showing you guys. So we're gonna put it all together now. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I'm wiping down the board as I go because I want it to be pretty for YouTube and for my guests. So now that we have the cheese out, I'm gonna show you guys that really quick. So that's the base of the board. So I know I showed you guys my haul from the Dollar Tree. This is from Walmart. These are from Walmart, but um, yeah, I just thought that these would be fun to have out for chips. So probably like the tortilla chips and the white truffle chips. I'll put them each in this and then I'll put the dips out in like a little ramekin or something. Yeah, ramekin on there. Okay. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to show you guys, they're really cute. I think I told you guys in my Trader Joe's video, they were like, oh, those fly off the... And then I went the week after and they were gone. So, all right. And I'm telling you guys, if you haven't tried these chips yet, the white truffle chips, they're so good. I read somewhere or seen something that they always say to cut off if you make it look like people have already eaten because when people come, they're too embarrassed to pick at it themselves. Like to be the first one ones to dig in. Oh. So always like be leave some so it looks like people ate. So fortunately for us, Juliana's eating it already. So, so I roll them to look like okay. this. I don't know if you can see if that'll focus in. All right, I'm gonna get started on the dry things, like the add-ons. I'm gonna probably put this little like fig jam into a couple of ramekins and set those somewhere as well. What I typically do is I put on the bigger items and then I start utilizing the little items to, to start fill. Uh -huh, to start fill. And, I and it'll just come together and you just have to put things where you feel they, they belong. There's not a right or wrong way to do this. You do whatever you feel is right. And I think the other important thing to remember is to put things on your board that you enjoy eating because sometimes yeah. the board um, isn't eaten. And I know that you know the cheeses you might need to throw away, but things that are non-perishable, you're gonna end up saving them. So you wanna make sure that those are things that you enjoy eating because you're the one that's gonna be stuck with them. That's very true. Okay, so I went ahead and put our little pumpkins out along with some apricots. This is what it's looking like so far. Here is the fig butter, nuts, cheese, apricots, chocolate cherries, the pumpkins. My mom's kind of starting on the crackers. It's looking good so far. I have olives and pickles, all kinds of stuff, you guys. Like, if I'm forgetting to tell you something and you see it on the board, just ask. I will fill you guys in. Okay, I'm gonna give you guys a little update. And I think I'm gonna put little toothpicks in the olives, that way people aren't like fishing around with their fingers. You want it to look full, overflowing. Yes. Abundant. Yes, exactly. Plentiful. Yes. I'm on one. All right. You guys, I'm sorry if we were talking and my dogs were just being obnoxious barking in the back. That is just something that we live with here in this house. It's very annoying, it is what it is. 
Okay guys, I'm now putting the dips in these little ramekins that we have over here for the chips. I'm just gonna spread these out somewhere on the little board. All right, you guys, so that is actually it. I think we're gonna start to display everything and just get everything put together and I will show you the final result. Here it is. I love the way that everything turned out. It was such a big hit. It was picked over all night. We definitely had a lot of leftover, but nothing that JD and I can't get through, I'm sure. All right, you guys, so that is going to do it for our charcuterie board. We're spent. It's hard work. What a day. Yeah. <laughs> we hope that you guys enjoyed it. It was pretty easy. Yeah, we had a good time. Together. It was fun. Uh, it's definitely gonna get eaten for sure. Like yes. I'm just looking at it like super excited to just. It looks delicious to dive right in. Dive right in. Yeah. Please don't forget to check everyone else's videos out and I'll leave everybody in the description box. You do not want to miss it, you guys. These recipes that were being talked about in the chat is like a lot more strenuous than this, what we've got going on right now, okay? I know that lobster mac and cheese was brought up. Some Disney World recipes are being thrown mm. into the mix, so definitely go check everybody out. Again, if this is the first video that you're seeing, welcome to my channel. My name is Erica. I do Disney content, mom content, vlogs, makeup, a little bit of everything, some DIYs. So if any of those sound of interest to you, please don't forget to subscribe before you leave. And uh, I think that's it. As always, I want to thank you for taking time out of your day to watch this video. Please be sure and subscribe to enjoy a full slew of awesome videos on Erica's channel. Nobody says slew, mom. A whole slew. <laughs> you forgot my yeah. outro. You're not a loyal okay. subscriber at all. I just want to thank you for taking time out of your day to watch another video of mine. Like always, I don't know. What does it say again? As always, I want to thank you for taking time out of your day to watch this video, and I hope to see you back for the next one. Okay. That's your line. And I hope to see you back for the next one. We'll I see how it. many tries this takes First you. try. No one ever does good with this. All right, you guys. As always, I want to thank you for taking time out of your day to watch this video. And I hope to see you back for the next one. <laughs> Just a casual pause. <laughs> and I hope to see you back for the, for next, the one. next one. See, you're like on the news all the time. I'll see you around. <laughs> That's it, no more. Okay, do it again. As always, I want to thank you for taking time. <laughs> Come on, we're so close, Mom. Let's go, pull it together. I'll see you around for the next one. No, okay. not I will see you around. <laughs> and I'll see you back. Back. And I hope to and see I you And I hope back. to see you back for the next one. Yes. Got it. Okay, are you, can you get it together? We're we not gonna film this intro right now. <laughs> All right, as always, I wanna thank you guys for taking time out of your day to watch this video. And I hope to see you around for the next one. No. <laughs> We're not seeing them around, Mom. <laughs> Stay around. I hope to see you back. back. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Oh my God. Okay, I got it. Okay. As always, I want to thank you guys for taking time out of your day to watch this video. And we hope to see you back for the next one. Bye. Bye. Finally, it took like 45 minutes. It's too bright with the things on. It's like my concealer ain't doing anything. But see, nothing. my he forehead is cut out. I know, well, look at me. See how good I am? Look at me, I'm backed up. <sighs> I look great. You had to do a little intro up. like this. You're backed up? I'm Erica's mom. <laughs> Okay, now. Okay, now we're gonna do an outro. Okay. So should we look like spent a little bit? No? <sighs> Wait, putting together that cheese board really wiped me out. Cutting the cheese is so hard. <laughs> <laughs> Your hands cut off yeah. again. I know. Okay, there. Okay, here. It's because I'm so, I'm taller. I know, there. Than you. Is that okay. better? Yeah, that's yeah. better. Okay, we should have done this because yeah. I'm yeah. closer to the camera, I look better. Oh, okay. God. Did you watch Shit's Creek yet? No. You should. Cut your shit. <laughs> Zoe. Zoe. You're not gonna be in the video. Mind your P's and Q's. <laughs> <laughs> well, now I'm cut off. Look it. Okay, go ahead. You take up the. Go ahead. I'll Is that more room? I want you to be in my video. Like... Come over. Hi, welcome to my channel. How would your intro go if you had a channel? Hi, this is Debbie. Yeah, you always. And I'm the like cool a... mom. No, you. 
<laughs> you mean girl. You always look like you're broadcasting for the news. You're like this, this is you. Look, let me have a paper. Like, hi, this is Debbie. <laughs> That's you every time. <laughs>